Thank you for joining me virtually from my home in Cleveland for this coronavirus concert. I hope that you are all healthy and well as we stay apart until we can be together again. Today's program is shaped by the Black Lives Matter movement. As a musician reflecting on restorative practices, it makes sense to start by playing more music by Black composers. Today, I will share the, the musical voices of two African-American, one French Afro-Cuban, and one Haitian American composer. All of the music was written in the 20th and 21st centuries. A big thank you to my friends Carrie and Andy of Weekend of Chamber Music for embracing this program. You have said before that we are all feeling blue lately. Well, connecting everything together, today's works have either the word blue in the title, have a feeling of melancholy, or are in the blues style. Composer George T. Walker was the first African-American to win the Pulitzer Prize for music. He wrote Bleu for his violinist son, Gregory, who has a wonderful recording of this work. This piece reminds me of the Isai solo violin sonatas mixed with some jazz turns. When I heard this piece live for the first time by my friend David Bolin, I knew it was a very, very special piece.
Dolores White is a Cleveland composer. I have known Dolores and members of her family over the years. Blue's Dialogues was inspired by her violinist son. You will definitely hear the musical sounds of the blues. And it's shaped with the European influences of the composer's classical training. It's a standout work.
I have a special guest joining me for the next work, which is a violin duet by French Afro-Cuban composer Amadeo Roldan Igarez. The title and the feel of the work say it all. A shout out to violinist and arranger of this work, Rachel Barton Pine, who has championed works by black composers around the world and has made it an important part of her life's work to publish and record them in a beautiful way. Daniel Bernard Romain is a Haitian-American musician making his mark in New York. He is an amazing violinist, activist, and composer. I met DBR during our studies at the University of Michigan back in the 90s. Love, love, love his music and his creative energy. This work uses the blues scale and there is free license to make Jimi Hendrix style sounds and it's a super fun way to go out. Please enjoy and thank you for joining me today.